All right, today for breakfast, I am going to be having salmon. As you can see right here, here's some salmon with onions, all right? And pasta, absolute goodness, all right? So let's get started. As you can see on the back burner, I have water boiling for the pasta. I have, okay, I have water boiling for the pasta. So I'm gonna get started with the salmon. I'm gonna start to heat up this pan and I'm gonna place the pasta within the boiling water. Absolute goodness. Let me go ahead and turn this on. All right. Turn this on right here. I'm going to turn this on. Have a little sip of my 100% All American coffee. Absolute goodness. All right. So, as this is heating up right here, I'm just going to get over here and get a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. All right. Absolute goodness. As well as a little bit of cooking spray. All right. So I have that, some salt, some pepper, and I am going to get some of this. I'm gonna add a little bit of flavoration. This is hamburger, hamburger seasoning. All right, I'm gonna add this to my salmon. All right, just a little bit to the salmon. Adds a nice little twist to it. I'm gonna add a little bit of pepper, just like that absolute goodness and a little bit of salt absolute goodness all right so this water is boiling right here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and add some pasta to the boiling water turn it back up to get it back to boiler rated all right so I'm just gonna add some pasta to the boiling water just a handful right there is all I need absolute goodness Put that in there, all right? You wanna take your fork and bend the pasta a little bit into the water, just like that. Absolute goodness. All right. And then, this pan is heating up. Let's see how hot it is. I'm gonna take this, not quite hot enough yet. I'm just gonna turn up the flame and get this started. Well, that's heating up right there. The water's boiling on the back burner. I'm gonna take a put piece of garlic, as you can see right here, 100% All-American garlic. And I'm going to go ahead and cut some garlic up, all right? Absolute goodness. So I'm gonna take this, peel this back right here, and then cut up a little bit of garlic and this is gonna be added to the salmon, all right? So cut that up. Just like that, put that to the side, all right? So the pan is heated up a little bit. I'm just gonna spray it a little bit with a cooking spray, all right? Just a little bit of cooking spray in there, all right? And then I am going to go ahead and add the salmon. Make sure it gets hot enough. Let's see how hot it is. It's getting there, not quite there. Give it a couple more seconds. While that's heating up, I'm just gonna go ahead and stir the pasta. All right. Make sure that the pasta is not sticking inside to each other. So I'm gonna take that. All right. And the, sal the salmon should be ready to be added to the pan. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take it, place the salmon right here. All right, it's gonna to start to cook. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to let this heat up just a little bit, and then I'm going to add the onions, and then followed up with that with the garlic. I love eating salmon with pasta for breakfast. Absolute goodness. All right, let me have another sip of my coffee. Right here, all American. Absolute goodness. All right, stir this a little bit. While this is starting to cook, I'm just gonna go ahead and add some onion to the side, all right? Now the onion is gonna add to the flavoration of this, all right? They're gonna cook down, so start to saute 
and really add to a lot of the flavor. Let me go ahead and zoom in so you can see what I'm working with right here. I'm going to zoom in for on the salmon. You can see me cooking. Let me stir the pasta a little bit make sure that's going well before I zoom in. So let's zoom in on the salmon while this cooks right here because this is looking really good. All right, I'm going to zoom in right there. All right. We're gonna cook this right here. I'm gonna go ahead and check up underneath this. See how well, look how well it's cooking right there. I might have to get a spatula because it's gonna want to flake off in a little bit. And I don't want it to flake too much. I want it to cook whole. All right, let me get my spatula. But before I do that, I'm gonna take a little bit of soya sauce. You see this right here? And I'm gonna put a little soya sauce right here, on there. All right, put a little bit of soya sauce on there for flavor. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take the salmon and flip it one time for the mind. Just like that, absolute goodness. Now, it's important that you check up on the onion and make sure that they don't burn too much or brown too much. All right, so I have that and now, Right about now, I'm going to go ahead and add in a little bit of garlic. All right, the garlic, you don't want to add it too early because if you add it too early, if you add the garlic too early, then it will burn. And that is something that we don't want to work, we don't want to happen. All right, so I add that, I can smell the soy sauce. In about a minute, I'll be able to smell the garlic. Absolute goodness, if you ask me. Right, we're just gonna go ahead and turn this around right here. Gonna chop up the garlic, make sure a lot of it gets to the bottom of the pan. All right, just like that. Just gonna take it and move it around a little bit because different parts of the pan reach different temperature. If you keep it in one spot too long, it turns into a cooler spot than the rest of the pan. So this is just gonna cook. As you can see, it's starting to cook on the outside. Move this right here. You see it's right there. It's not cooked quite on the inside, but uh, the longer we have it in here, the more it's gonna cook cooked on the, on the uh, inside. So I'm gonna just stir this. Maybe put some of the onion on top of it. And this will allow the flavoration of permeate down into the salmon. All right, smelling good, smelling great. This is gonna taste better than a steak. Absolute goodness. All right, let's go keep on checking on this. Move it around. Look at that, salmon, smelling good. Smelling great. Smell good. Let me zoom out so we can check. go ahead and check up on the pasta. All right, there's a the pasta up there. Go, I can start to smell the garlic in there cooking. All right, so check up on the pasta. Pull out a couple of pieces of pasta. Tasting great. It's almost al dental. It's getting there. Check up on the salmon. Oh man, it's smelling so good. Come up here. Come up the screen. Let's come in here so you guys can smell this right here. Come in here, smell that. Smell the onion. Smell the garlic. All right, it's starting to caramelize a little bit down here, which is good. Just long as it doesn't burn. All right, we do not want the garlic to burn. I do not like the flavoration of burnt garlic. All right. The smell the samo. All right. I'm gonna flip this one more time because we want this to cook evenly without it crisping on one side or the other too much. Let's go ahead and check up on it. I'm gonna go ahead and flip this. Now look at that. Look at that. Perfecto. Go ahead and put some onions on top like that. Turn the flame down just slightly. 
All right. Turn this down and let the heat just continue to cook through the salmon. All right, I'm gonna zoom out really quick. The pasta should be about done. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna strain the pasta. All right, let me go ahead and get my strainer out. Get my strainer out. And I'm gonna do the French method. I'm classically trained ramen noodle chef in the French cuisine, and I'm gonna do it how we do it in France, okay? I'm gonna take the pasta, I'm just gonna fork it into my strainer like this. Look at that. Cooked perfect to al dente. Smelling great, tasting great. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the salmon off and let the heat finish cooking it all. So I strain this. And so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna drain the water. All right, let me go ahead and drain the water. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of all-American spaghetti sauce to the pan. Then I'm gonna add the pasta to it. And then stir this around. The heat is still going on here, so I'm just stir this around. Put a little bit of all-American Italian olive oil in there. Just a little bit. Now, the purpose of doing it like this is because if you heat it a little bit, the pasta still will absorb some of the all-American pasta sauce. All right, we're gonna let that keep on heating just for a second. Meanwhile, I'm gonna get my plate ready. I'm gonna go ahead and turn of the Samyong. Get my plate ready. All right. Gonna go ahead and turn off the pasta. Just give it one more swirl. All right. And I'm gonna take the pasta. Put it on the plate like this. Absolute goodness. And then I'm gonna take the Samyong. Put it on the corner right here for decorative purposes. Look at that, look at the on y'all. Let me go ahead and get all the rest of the on y'all off of this. Just like this, it is smelling good in here right now. All right, take a look at this. Samyong with pasta for breakfast. Absolute goodness if you ask me, absolute goodness.